Okay, this is part two of the uh, service front loader stripped down. Uh, this is the front panel. We're going to remove the panel now, get it out of the way. And uh, this is the on and off switch here. Uh, the way you remove this is there is um, you can remove the whole thing, including the button. There's a tab there and a tab there. And you're simply just going to push the screwdriver in there to lift the tab up. So we're going to push the tab in this side. Push that tab in this side. Tugging at the switch. And as he comes, has to switch off. So now we're going to remove this ribbon connector here. Just push it to one side slightly while you're lifting it a bit, and it should pop out just like that. There we are. Take that out of the way, and then we can remove this front panel. Right. It's uh, confessions time now. Um, and not perfect. I broke the side of this socket off here. Um, so I'm going to have to, when I come to reassemble it, I'm going to have to fix something up with that to secure the plug properly. But it's not, um, it's nothing too drastic. We can sort that out. And the next job we're going to do now is uh, we'll, we'll remove the door interlock next. It's just two Phillips screws that hold the interlock in place. And that then comes out. And there's the interlock off. I'm going to remove the uh, drain pump and as you can see, we've led the machine down um, on a bit of carpet on its right hand side. Now to remove the pump, there's the uh, wiring, the power supply to the pump there, there's the hose here, drain hose there, and there's this hose here which goes up to the dispenser drawer. And there are two number 10 bolts to undo underneath. So we'll start by taking these two number 10 bolts out here from underneath. in the wiring and take the drain hose out of the way the water left is in the sump hose is a, it's a flat head just take the flat head loosen that off from the this is the sump drain hose here that's the lead the power supply for the pump pull that out now we can bring the pump out here struggle with this one and there we are there's the pump head okay now if you really feel the urge to take the pump apart um, just here there's a tab which you have to push down now there's one of those tabs here and there's also one here so you have to push them both down to get it out easily push the tab down then push the pump anti-clockwise touch and off it comes and you turn it slightly and there we are there's your pump the impala your seal and the housing you can undo this from outside the machine of course to check for any blockages And that's how you take your pump apart.